Did you wake up this morning and realize this lovely, lovely little Windows icon in your system tray here? This one. Right here. That's what I'm talking about. This one. Well, it's called the Windows 10 Upgrade Tool. And today I'm going to show you how to remove it from your computer. But before I do that, I'm going to show you what it looks like. So everybody out there that wants to be nosy or curiosity or whatever, I'm going to show you what it looks like. This is the first one. Second one. Third one. Fourth one. Fifth one. Now, in order to remove this, what you need to do is go to your control panel. Go to your control panel right here. And once you get to your control panel, you want to click on programs and features. And then inside of there, you want to click right here where it says view installed updates and click on there. And the update that we're looking for is this one right here, update from Microsoft Windows KB3035583. Now, in order to get rid of this little upgrade tool here, you want to uninstall this one. This is the deadly one right here, the one that keeps making this appear right here. This one right here, KB3035583. That's the one. So we're going to uninstall it. So once you click on it, go up here to uninstall, to uninstall it. It says, are you sure you want to uninstall this update? Yes, we are sure. That way we can get rid of this little annoying Windows 10 upgrade tool. Not everybody wants to upgrade from Windows 8 or Windows 7. They like their operating system. They're happy with it. So in case like that, why upgrade? I mean, if people want to upgrade, they will upgrade. But right now, if I'm not mistaken, I think it's still in the preview version. So a lot of people are still weary about that. Now it's uninstalling. It says it may take it a few minutes. And then it says you must restart your computer to apply these changes. Before restarting, save any open files. But we're not going to restart right now. I'm going to restart later, which is perfectly fine either way. But yeah, that's how you get rid of this little upgrade feature and if it installs it again then it will come back so what you need to do is go and hide go in your windows update and hide that particular update so it doesn't come back i want to thank you for watching my video on how to get rid of the windows 10 upgrade tool if you have any questions feel free to leave me a comment or message me and I will try to do all I can to help you. Thank you again for watching my video. Please like if it helps you. Please subscribe for more great videos. <laughs>